today we're heading up to check out Richard's caddy. He's in the back. Hey Richard. <laughs> yeah. It should be in primer. We'll just drop you off another few bits and just going through the final process of, of what it should look like at the end. And uh, who better to ask than the guy who, who's paying for the build. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we're going to check it out. Sick. So um, Saturday I got Richard to come down finally to pop up and have a look at the caddy. Uh, I, I mean, I encourage all my customers to come down and have a look at the stages throughout the build. I mean, I'm building their dream car, what, they, what they've always wanted. I want them to be involved as much as possible. Um, so yeah, uh, he came down, we rolled, rolled up to, uh, up to Jazz's in Lewis Road. We had a good look. I mean, the caddy's an etch primer at the moment. Everything's been pulled. Um, I want to use as little filler in it as possible. Um, so all the dents we got as, as as much out as we can, or as Jazz got as much out as we can with the puller. Uh, etch primer now, so it's been so it's, so it's ready for filling. It is really good. You happy? Yeah, I love it. Cool. Worth the trip? Yeah, definitely. But this is the stuff you've got to see, man. Yeah. Because it's your build, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. I mean, you can't. I, I don't like hiding people in the dark with this yeah. and stuff. That's why I'm so open about it all. Yeah. You, know, you come up, you check it out, you, you, you gotta remember this. You, you, you never know, you may keep this rest of your life. Yeah. And if you do, then you remember coming up here yeah. and seeing this shit. Which is epic. Stick it to it. <laughs> uh, so, came back then and then I had a friend, uh, Crowley, he rocked up and, I mean, without fail, he always brings something insane. And he brought up his, uh, He's Zephyr, and oh my god, what a what a what a machine! Uh, 5.7, which is a 347 stroke kit in it, 500 brake horse, and she got a C6 gearbox, which is in an F150. Yeah. Uh, he said he threw the keys at me. He said go for a spin. Uh, I came back with the police in tow. <laughs> I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. I think he was more more wanting to see what it was and. Uh, and check out the shop, which was which was cool. He ended up staying here for a little bit and checking everything out. It was uh, I, I love anybody turning up at the shop. Doesn't matter what what you do. <laughs> but um, but yeah, I mean Crowley's car is sick. It's sick. It's <laughs> sick in it. <laughs> BCs are incredible, aren't they? So they kind of like the height. Doesn't matter how high or low you run it, they um, they always remain the same. The ride remains the same. They, they lower into socks, basically. So uh, yeah, we'll do a bit more adjusting and see what it looks like. Yeah. Got the old Strad Moderners. Put them back together this week. Uh, sealed them all up, ready for tires. We test fit the wheels, put the BC coilovers on. Just wanted to see exactly where the tire over the wheel sat. So, what decision to go on tires? This car is going to have big power, so I didn't want to be putting like a stretch, sort of like skinny seam tire on the back. Say hello to my little friend. Oh no! Oh, oh no! <laughs> Greg! Yeah. Do you have another one, dude? Round two? We'll try again. 
clearly don't know my own strength. I f***ed this shit up. <laughs> Next up, we're gonna get tires for the disease. Off the bridge, stop grinding, you can hear me. We've already done the test fit, it went sweet. There's gonna have to be a bit of a uh, camber out to the frog because they're eight and a half, so it's a little bit tight. But the shell looks sick. Uh, I wanted to roll with something fat. So then nine and a half in the back, eight and a half in the front. Should be on its on its feet tomorrow. We're putting some tires on uh, and and see and see how uh, how we can stand it. What we need to do to the arches and modifications and bits and pieces. Then we start work on the engine. Uh, it has to be pulled out because uh, because of I just want to go right through it. So we're going to do a belt on it, water pump, and all those normal service stuff. So when the new customer has it when it goes up for sale. We have gone right through the car. It'll be perfect. Um, keep watching. Keep on Instagram. Keep checking it out. And uh, I'll uh, update you next week. Take care. Ciao. Out.